Hello everybody and welcome back to Blood for Land. I'm here with the Magistrate and our really creepy faceplate helmet. It's, uh, the eyebrows. <laughs> the eyebrows though. And, uh, I think we're gonna go on to the next one. We're gonna do the Great Desert, which is the Lady, I think? Yeah, the Empress of the Desert. Ha, yes, I remember this one. Okay. So I think the best thing we can do here is have most of our men hold down there and then have archers hold up here for now that is until we get uh, enough boosts going and uh, like a what, what is it what is it called a fortress build is it a fortress is it a a what word am I looking for I don't have a horse though so I'm honestly kind of looking to get knocked out so I can spawn myself back in as a uh, a, um, someone, someone, anything cavalry on a horse, you know, preferably of the hooved, uh, hooved variety. I'm trying to locate what would be a cut downable tree, and I think that one's one, maybe? That, it looks suspicious. <laughs> that is a quite suspicious tree. Uh, that one might be. I don't, not exactly sure. We'll figure out. But something I want to talk about is the possibility, I talked about it a little bit last episode, uh, the possibility of playing For Honor. I don't, it's it's tempting. The combat's really nice looking, but it's peer-to-peer, -peer, so it, the, the connection can be just absolutely shitty a lot of the time. And uh, other than that, their, their method of, like, uh, of you buying things in game is horrible. It's it's super scammy. It's it's based on rather than playing, you can pay to progress faster. It's one of those types of PvP games. But I don't know. It still tempts me a lot, just because of the uh, play type, and supposedly it will match you with people of equal level. So the people that pay to progress will only really just put themselves against better fighters. So hopefully then. Uh, you're not really fighting anyone way over your level, or way over your skill level even. You're just fighting, like, similarly horrible people. And those people that paid to progress are now fighting people way beyond themselves. Come on. Oh, I found one that has more armor. There we go. Ah! I like how I actually have the same weapon as these guys here. Who are you? Ow. Lady of the Sands. Are you another Lady of the Sands? Oh, you were. That's that's very much past tense. Ooh. Ouch. Let's get all the things we can that have to deal with food. I want barracks. I want barracks badly. Actually, I want the stable first. <laughs> Honestly. I need that stable. Oh, we just need gold. Well. Oh, shit. That broke my shield. Madam, I will have to ask you to surrender, else I will kill you. I think I've actually done fairly well fighting these people. I mean, I definitely haven't done that good because I've lost a significant amount of health and I shouldn't have against basic troops. But I mean, I've, I've done okay. I'm used to being able to ride by and stabby. Just ride by and stab, stab, stab. Uh, that's... Is that archers? I don't see who's shooting at me from over there. Oh, it's the guys in gold. It's the, uh... The Empress. However, the Empress actually... Has, uh... What am, what am I... What am I trying to say? The Empress is actually the doubled one in the middle I think because I don't think they have the correct models for them in this one it's uh or maybe they do I don't know I'm, I may be confused but all the other times I've seen I believe the person in gold armor is supposed to be the enemy leader in each map and they don't seem to be any different but they they're probably different stat wise and everything this gives our oh I just spawned myself as an axeman this was a poor mistake. I was like, let's spawn some axemen just to reinforce 
You know, re reinforce everything. Where did that keep spawn? Where's our keep? It's over there. Uh, that ain't too great. Um, everyone follow me. Just, you know, this other Axeman. Okay, those guys are just kind of chilling, apparently. That's fine. I'm fine with this. <laughs> That's perfectly acceptable, honestly. Let's put everyone here. Everyone. Actually, let's put everyone up on this hill. Hey, you. Hey, you're... You missed. That's my base. Excuse me, sir. Sir, that's my base. Okay, maybe we want them down here still. Sir, can you please kill me? Please. Faster. Oh my gosh. You are not going to kill me by the time my allies get over here. Wow. Hey, that's some good armor on my axemen, though. Oh, because I told them to go over there. This is pretty good, though. Hey, that's pretty good armor if I have to get hit this many times intentionally to get knocked out. That's pretty damn good. Um, Do I just want to be a light cavalry? Or do I want to be a sterling cavalry? Yes! Okay, this is nicer. I don't really say, like, it's very nice, but it's nicer. Okay, now, um, you know what? Let's just charge. What we do need to do, though, definitely, is hire some keep archers. Do you hire or do you create them? This is one of the things I've been confused about on various occasions. Am I hiring people or I am, am I, like, demanding that my villagers, uh, birth some keep archers and, like, specifically? Let's do this, buddy. Hit me. Oh, man, that was a good one. Oh, you actually hit my horse. Stop. Okay, well, my men got to him. Okay, these guys are going to be stupid and run ahead on their own. I would like you all to wait, like, right there. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. That was, that was bad. Oh, come on. I just need to be shot, Cav. I mean, let's be honest. I'm better at shot, Cav. Uh, sword militia because they're amazing with the upgrades. And then Frisians? No, apparently not Frisians. Okay, they can charge now because we're probably facing. Okay, I'm I'm better with just so short range sorting things. Even though I'm riding by, you just ride by like essentially close enough to run them over. And swing. Ah, <laughs> oh, I swung over her head. The shame. A light sands soldier. That is a lot of men. You kidding me? That's a lot of men. These guys don't even see me. This is pitiful. Oh my goodness. This is beautiful. Oh my gosh. Only one turned to fight. They are dedicated. They are... Oh my goodness. These guys freaking know what they're doing. Okay, so it looks to me like cavalry can totally wreck this map. So let's... Oof. Ooh, that lag. Damn. Okay, let's save some of our gold for other matters. That is a crossbowman. That's not a Frisian. Sterling cavalry? Do we want some sterling cavalry? Why not? And then we will just get some light cavalrymen. And that should do us really well. We're already crushing pretty good, but we are pressing forward harder than we have been uh, in other maps lately. But this formation could really screw us. But you know what I'm going to do. Surprise. Oh, plus we have some shock cav coming in anyway. They better keep riding though. I I think there's a problem with shock cav is that they try to use the normal AI. And it's like, there needs to be a very specific AI for shock cav. I think he did, or the creator, I can't really say he, I don't really know. 
but uh, they did really well with just giving them only the lance because that's gonna force them to take a run up every time they do like anything at all and this map is just fallen very quickly to our upgraded soldiers but that's nice that doesn't happen a whole lot especially on hard mode like I mean let's see we've gotten crushed twice now or three times might have been three times honestly I don't it's at least twice it could be three though I, I don't remember there was that one that's that special quest in uh, special quest that's another one that's like a uh, sand desert type people uh, we're losing some people excuse me we should not be losing anyone um, excuse regions deal with this please immediately I need some caravans we need we need some bigger income here okay that's all that we can get we can get some some more light cavalrymen though I'd like some composite bowmen to go like up here maybe yeah archers up there how are we doing on this men men you are not doing well on this men really Oh man, look at the chunk I take out of this though. That's insane. Oh my gosh. Okay. Yeah, Empress Riata was knocked out. Oh, I should have looked earlier. I was facing someone in the gold armor. I should have uh, knocked them out and seen if that was actually Princess Riata or if that was just like a... It could be like a defender that I'm thinking of that's in the gold armor all the time. It honestly might be. But, uh... Yeah. Script warnings. Uh. Oh, watchtower. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. I love that I actually had to knock that out to be able to get to this, though. So that my men would actually do anything with it, you know? Because if I didn't get that one out, my men would just be stuck over there. Okay, that makes me feel better that this one takes longer. And I didn't just... They took our keep out, apparently. Uh, do I need to go check on... Do I need to check on our... Our place to see if... If everyone back there is okay? Uh... We still have a keep. Did it say just keep Archer? And I... That's confusing. I could have swore it said build keep. There's still some arrows stuck up there. Okay, well, we're going to have to help with this one, apparently. Our men are doing pretty decent at it. But we're going to speed it along. And I'm going to actually continue recording. We're going to actually finish a battle this time. I usually stop it at the end, but wow. Oh, my squires were killed. Oh, shit. Hey, look. The enemy has upgraded substantially very quickly. Men! Men! Onward! Uh. Wow, desert conscripts are crushing. Um. Yeah, I was knocked out. Okay, understandable. Uh, light cavalrymen? Get in there! Maybe I should not be summoning light cavalrymen. They are too lightweight. Oh my goodness, desert conscripts are too much. Okay, archers, stay here. And everyone else should be coming back to me. Oh my goodness, we got overrun really fast. I mean, we're not overrun, like overrun, overrun, but it's still not good. That's a lot of enemies that are very strong. Okay, let's control these guys. Should, should have uh, spawned myself as a shock cav. We could have taken care of a lot of, of foot soldiers with that. However, I think I can take care of a lot of these guys. Well, there's some of them that are just the, uh, the ladies. But I can apparently stall out a lot of enemies like this. Okay, that's annoying, buddy. <laughs> 
You get yourself killed faster if you shoot at me. So just watch yourself, bud. Hey. Hey. Spears ain't cool. That did a lot of damage to that guy for him to survive. Okay, there we go. And just circling the enemy should average my my troops to be on top of them. If I'm right. Maybe. As long as they don't turn around like that. Circling them should actually average my troops to be on top. Like like directly on them. That's a lot of men. Come on. Come on. That's a lot of men. Okay, that sounded female. Oh, I almost got lanced. Okay, we're doing good. A lot of our people got knocked out, but we're fine. Maybe. Okay, sword militia is probably going to help out here. But, I really want to try using a lot of shock cav. I want to see what this does. It could be really good. Or it could be absolutely horrible, and I really don't know which is the case. Oh my gosh, all these strikes are beautiful. Oh, I wish riding by and swinging even uh, could break a shield with even just a sword. Because, I mean, if you're going fast enough, it's not going to matter. You know? Like, it should do severely reduced damage, but still. Like, come on. We gotta do something. Let's just charge, and then we'll have Cav. Actually, no, Cavalry can follow me. So that I can hopefully... Actually, no, we'll just tell them to charge. Maybe they'll actually run in in bursts, like I hope. Or we just see a lot of shock Cavalry die really fast. And I'm gonna have to play this slow after the recording. I don't want to do it again. Uh, playing them slow after the after I quit recording is like murder. I want to play it like you know fast and loose. Maybe I should have started on medium again. Could have been what would uh, have matched my play style better. Okay, so that is Empress Riata. That I just like decapitated on a ride by. At least I can kill really easy with this. I mean, if, if my allies were as good as I was with the class, we wouldn't have any issues, now would we? Friends, quote unquote. Okay, Sword Militia are doing a job back here. But, like, where are you guys at? Not enough resources. We have wood. Oh, it takes wood and iron. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Cav beats uh, infantry. No. Cav beats melee. Ranged beats infantry. But the amount of range it takes to break through a shield is not, not reasonable in the least. Can I just, like, ride by, hit it a few times, and go on? That would be hilarious if you could actually take it down with everyone there without ever beating an enemy. Oh, I was going to laugh so hard if I actually killed the princess. Or the empress. Princess. <laughs> Whatever. Oh. My horse took one for the team. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. How are we doing? Are we on the are we on the top side here? I don't think we're I don't think we're winning. I don't think we're winning. I don't think we're winning. Oh no. Oh no. I need to be a shock cav. We can do this as shock cav. Oh, oh well. That's the end of the episode. I hope you've enjoyed this episode. If you did leave a like, it really does help out. Until next time, have a nice day and I'll see you later.